So the project we were doing was healthy landscapes for healthy livestock and it was about educating the private landholders within the Shire to become more sustainable. We have information courses, we have field days like we're out on here today to give practical knowledge to people. We have webinars and we have that one-on-one that -on -one visit. For the Shire, it's just critically that, that um, that it's everyone is involved in getting greater sustainability outcomes. There's plenty of knowledge on the internet, plenty of information there. It's about tailoring that to the particular needs of that particular landholder. That's certainly impacted people's lives. People are excited about getting out there on the land now with the tools that Jason and myself have given to them in the course that we're running. And they're gonna be, uh, you know, doing things without Use, use a whole big use of chemicals and things that are not sustainable. Uh, high inputs, they're going to um, look to other ways using animals. It's inspiring for me, you know, when I go out and visit these magnificent properties and, you know, I've got a real appreciation for what they're trying to do on their property. We, we've learnt a lot about the grass, what they're standing on, kind of the whole I guess life cycle of soil and grass and, and everything else that's in the grass. You know, before it was just looking out in a paddock and going, oh yeah, there's there's stuff in there, let's put the cattle on there. But now it's it's more about, okay, what's there? What stage is it at? How can the cattle or horses help it? It's funny to walk around now and, and you're always looking down and you're looking at, you know, what's here, what life is here or, or what lack of life is here and, and what can we do to change that? Winning the, the Premier Sustainability Award was was absolutely awesome. Joining these type of awards gives recognition. So I encourage people to be involved in these type of things because you just don't know whether you're doing something unique that no one else has seen or is doing. There is a lot of misunderstandings out there by people about farming and anything industrial isn't good and there is industrial farming, but the way we farm, which is sustainable, um, it's regenerative, people need to know and need to come and see us the way we farm we allow that on our farm to see that we're actually promoting grasslands we've helped biodiversity is improving animals are healthy the landscape's healthy i think farmers don't want to ruin their land they want to look after their land and that's sustainable <laughs>